Hey guys, this is Darren with Everyman Tech, and today we will be installing the Logitech G Hub software via a Windows computer. So just follow along, and I will explain every step of the way so you guys can install it on your computer at home. So, first thing you want to do is go on to www.logitech.com, and you should come up to this screen here. And depending on when you're installing this, this is actually the home screen may change but nonetheless you should definitely be on logitech.com so once we on the home page we're going to go over to support right here we're going to click on to go down to support go down to the drop down menu and scroll over to downloads click downloads and it will take you to how can i help you you can either type in the mouse that you're looking for or if you know where to look, you can, or you just go down to the other options because this is software as well. You will be using this web page to install software for any other devices from Logitech that you may have. So in our case, we'll go down to mice and pointers, the top left. Then we'll scroll down to the mouse of our choosing. In this case, we'll, we're looking for the Logitech G502 Hero Edition and you just keep scrolling until you find it and if you don't see it initially you just go to see more so we a little bit more scrolling and okay i'm gonna try one more time got to see more well how about this we'll just go to gaming mice right here in the top you'll see where it says gaming mice Okay, so if you're scrolling and you don't see it right away, we can just do a shortcut because ours might be all the way down the bottom. So we'll just type in G502 Hero. Here we go. And here's the mouse that we're looking for right here. So we'll just double click that guy there. And here we go. So we clicked the mouse, went over to downloads, and now you see where it says a Logitech G Hub software. So the next, all we'll have to do is hit the download now. But just a quick note this does support Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 10. But by now, everybody should be on Windows 10. But if you, in case if you are one, somebody who does have Windows 7 or Windows 8, you can still install the software so after that you just hit download now then you'll see in the bottom left of your screen over here in the corner you'll say you'll see the file where it downloads or in some cases you can scroll up and actually see it over here in the bar depending on what web browser some web browsers allow actually you see the downloads in real time but in our case ours is in the bottom left of your screen and most windows computers install download files this way so you just want to click open file Then you'll come with the Logitech G Hub screen, value control, and what we're going to do is say yes. This doesn't take over your computer, this just allows the software to install onto the hard drive. And in our case, we already have the software installed. But if, if, if you don't have it, when you initially install it the first time, you're going to get a screen asking you to install. You just hit yes, just follows the prompts and it will take you to where you need to go and it's pretty much a step-by-step -step process just follow along with the guide and it's going to take you to all the exact steps that you need in order to 